Okay, so yesterday was not the best game we have ever played when it comes to head-to-head -head seasons, and I made a little bit of changes to the lineup, just briefly, actually only one thing, I took out um, Alex Gordon and I put Andrew McCutcheon back in the starting lineup, I have uh, Matt Holiday on the bench now, Alex Gordon, good fielder, but he just doesn't really have a spot in my lineup, so I wanted to test him out, but you know what didn't work out, sometimes the good ones go, man, sometimes you gotta move on to other fish in the sea, and Alex Gordon, it just wasn't working out. But hopefully this next game can end a little bit better than yesterday's game because yesterday was brutal, it was tough to play, probably tough to watch at some points, but let's go ahead and get into another one and see if we can bounce back. All right, we are taking on the Toronto, you can read his name. He has got uh, Francisco Lindor, Andrew McCutcheon, Ken Griffey Jr., and he's starting Matt Latos. That's that new, I think that's a breakout Matt Latos. He's also got his 99 creative player in there. So a pretty good lineup, but uh, we've got Dennis Eckersley on the mound again. Hopefully he can have a little bit of a better game. All right, we he's 21 and 22, so he, I mean, I can't say anything. I'm 1 and 4. First pitch of the game to Starlin Marte. Sinker and Goldie's making a play. a boy. Up and in, sinker. Two strikes to Lindor. Oh, I missed the pitch, but he didn't swing anyway. Let's go. Nice pitch. This is his created player. I'm a little nervous. Oh, my goodness. He missed the fastball. He missed that so bad. Come on, Reggie, make a play. Wow, we got away with one there, guys. Luck may be on our side this game. Oh, 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 stay fair. Oh, he touched it in fair territory. Ian Kinsler with the one out bunt, swinging bunt, base hit, I guess. Out of boy. And then Reggie Jackson right up the middle. Reggie is so clutch. He's got 78 speed. We're going to try to get in there at third. And we're in. Aggressive base running. But Ian Kinsler got hurt. Here we go, guys. You, <laughs> you know it's coming. You know the cheese is coming out to play. And then we get the inside-out swing. Oh, my goodness. Maybe it's going my way today, guys. Maybe it's going my way today. We've got an inside pitch, a sinker on the hands to Paul Goldschmidt. Takes it to right field on a just late swing. And we get an RBI double out of it. Oh, my goodness. And then, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that staying? Dude, what was up with that camera angle? Ah, then I popped up with Buddy Bell. Only scored one run this inning. Should have definitely been way more. Messed up there big time. Two strikes to McCutcheon. Slider low and away. He rolled over it. Come on, you got to make a play here, Buddy Bell. Make a play. Ooh, the defense is nice. Oh, there it goes. Justin Turner, one out. Base hit on the sinker inside. Pretty much saw that coming. I missed that spot. So here we go. Let's get a double play. Facing... 92 Kung Fu Kenny for this double play. Ooh, beautiful slider. I really wish Eckersley had a change up. That would make my life a lot easier. Ooh, we got Griffey out. One more out. Let's go. Up and in with a four seamer to Pedroia. Looked like he was waiting kind of for that spot. We got him to pop up, get a little underneath it. McCutcheon's there. All right, there we go. Got out of that one. Oh, there we go. There we go. Jonathan Lucroy going all the way to the wall. Let's go, 54 speed, you better get in there at second, big guy. Oh, the throw is offline. Jonathan Lucroy with a double on a 3-0 count. Let's just move him over here, Dennis. Come on, do your thing. Do your job, move him over. Ooh, we almost put one over the third baseman's head. No way, no way. That's dropping, that's dropping. Dennis Eckersley is gonna get an RBI double. This game is insane, that might be a triple. We're gonna try it, 22 speed, I don't even care. We're going, we're going. <laughs> A triple for the pitcher. All right, 3-2 count to Trey Turner. Oh, no. What am I doing? That slider was literally... Ah, it was already caught by the time I swung. Terrible. Oh, Buddy Bell. Buddy Bell. Oh. Oh. Buddy Bell with the gold glove plays today. Oh, my goodness. Look at Buddy Bell going full extension for this ball. Oh, what a beast. Reggie Jackson, come on, get down, get down, get down. Oh, dude, his outfielders are struggling today. I feel so bad for this kid right now. The game is just really hurting him. But all right, we got a leadoff double with Reggie. And it's going to be a ground ball for Goldie, but it'll get him to third. Gets the runner over. That's, that's fine with me. 
Oh, that's deep. Out to right field with Ken Griffey out there. I'm going to try and score him. I'm trying it. 74 speed. The throw is going to be offline. We're going to score. Sacrifice fly for Andrew McCutcheon. Another run added to the lead. All right, we've got the two, three, and four hitters coming up. I got to face Lindor. I got to face his creative player. So this is a big inning right here. We're, we're scoring runs, but we got to make sure we can shut him down. So got to throw some quality pitches, get some quality strikes. But it looks like he's getting a little patient up there. Okay, okay. Oh, he took the slider right where it was pitched. That's just great hitting right there. That's not cheese. That's nothing of the sort. You just hit the ball well. Good, good. Hey, got to tip my cap. All right, we got two strikes on his creative player. Let's hit him with a curveball right here. Swing over it. Ah, I got a little too much in the zone. We probably would have had him too. Let's go with a sinker up and in. Oh, I really thought I was going to get that too. I'm going back to that pitch. There it is. Ooh, just dropped right in on him. Yes, 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 yes. Got McCutcheon to pop out on a four seam up and in. Now we can just leave him stranded there at second. Come on, finish this inning, Dennis. Me and Dennis are on a first name basis. We go way back. Make a play. So you get out of a jam right there, fellas. So I don't know if you guys know, but the new patch notes, or you probably know if you have been playing the game since the new patch came out, but in the feedback, wait, is that leaving the yard? Is that getting out? Oh, warning track power for Reggie. But now the feedback meter for hitting, every time it's going to show the buckshot feedback. Now, buckshot is the most accurate out of all of them, apparently, because buckshot, the, the art for it is more accurate. So if you actually hit the ball on the bad part of the bat, like if, if you don't hit it on the sweet spot, it's going to show more accurate on the feedback meter than it would if you were using wedge or reticle or any of that. So if you're wondering why the thing changed to buckshot, it's just because it's the most accurate in terms of the artwork. And we got his creative player to pop up on a fastball inside. Thank you, Lucroy. Sometimes catchers in this game make some very questionable decisions, but we, we're good there. Atta boy. Then a ground ball from McCutcheon, 78 speed, you better get it there. There we go, two down. And another one off the end of the bat. Well, even if that was off the end of the bat, that went deep. But three pitches, three outs. Dennis Eckersley having the game of his life right now. Dennis Eckersley may have thrown a perfect game or he may have done something that I don't know about, but right now he's having the game of his life with the California Nuts. I can already see all the comments coming in like, Dennis Eckersley threw a no-hitter, he did all of these things. I'm just, he's throwing a great game for me, okay? By the way, Eduardo Nunez just hit a double. We're going to try and steal third. He's on the move. He threw a curveball. We're in there. No throw. Caught him off guard. That should be a steal. There we go. Thank goodness we got the late swing. Those things are definitely on our side this game. The late swings sometimes are really annoying when it comes to me. I mean, they're always really annoying, but... Sometimes I don't get them like I should. Now I'm actually getting them this game. All right, let's go. Eighth inning. Don't let up. The game's not over yet. I want to get Griffey out again. I love getting Griffey out. We got him with the first pitch sinker. Go with a slider low and in. Hopefully this doesn't catch the lower part of the zone. And he's going to get on. Dang it. Oh, he got a great jump. Uh, he's going to stay out of the double play, but he got a great jump there. Buddy Bell, though, still making these plays out here. All right, 2-1 count. I'm going with a sinker up and in. Oh, you can't spot a pitch any better than that. Let's go with a four seam there now. Underneath it, swinging right through it. One more out. Latos up. Is he going to pinch hit? Yes, he is. He brought in that breakout David Peralta. That card is nasty against righties, so I do have to be really careful right here. So hopefully I can just get him to swing at a little bit of junk because I don't really want to pitch to this card. I do have an open base. But I don't want to have to face the top of the order. I'm going to go fastball up here, but above the zone. Dennis Eckersley! And we're popping up with Lucroy. All right. Hopefully four runs can hold it. You never know in this game, especially with me, especially with my pitching. Eckersley has thrown a good game so far. We're going to give it to him in the ninth. But uh, he's gonna be, he is going to be on a short leash. All right. Starlin Marte is first. Pretty much the top of his order. First pitch swinging, popping up to Goldschmidt. As long as you make this play, Paul, one down. All right, how do I want to face Lindor? Lindor hit a double on an outside slider, so I don't want to give him an outside pitch. 
I'd rather just give him stuff on the inside half. And there it is. Pop up to Buddy Bell. Buddy Bell making plays all game. You can't expect anything less now. Curveball. He keeps fighting off everything. And he won the battle. Oh, my God. That was like a nine pitch at bat. Come on. I can't take him lightly right here. He's got good speed on the bases now. Just get him out at second. And we're good. All right, guys. We actually got a W. Yes. Dennis Eckersley, complete game shutout. Nine innings pitched, six strikeouts, no walks, only five hits. Paul Goldschmidt, two for four with two doubles and two RBIs. Buddy Bell having web gems left and right. Oh, I'm so happy, dude. We finally got back on the winning track. It took a while. The start of this season has been brutal, so it feels really good to win a game. But there you go, guys. We finally got a W. Feels really good. Thank you so much for watching. Before this video ends, I want to let you guys know about a little promotion that's going on right now. If you are not familiar, with the website FanDuel. It's a daily fantasy sports website where you can build a team every day, compete against somebody for real money. So instead of having your team that you draft at the beginning of the year, you just have a different team every day. If you would like to try the website out for yourself and you want to register, uh, use the promo code Coogs when you're going in to register. I will be hosting tournaments and stuff on FanDuel. So like, you know, people who use my code will be getting invites to tournaments and stuff like that. So if you are interested in doing that, go to FanDuel.com and just register your account and make sure you type in promo code Coogs as you're registering. But thank you guys very much for watching. I really hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop a thumbs up on this video. Make sure to subscribe so you never miss any more MLB The Show 17 videos. And guys, that is all I have for you today. So I hope you enjoyed. And until the next video, I will see you later.